Let's go to school. Christopher Columbus came over in 1492. And there were people here. Scholars have to rely on archaeology sites for dating. Some say people were in North America 20,000 years ago, 10 million years ago, 50 million years ago, 100 million years ago. Most say 20,000. All education systems teach that people walked here, then settled. This migration theory is called the land bridge theory. There were different groups with completely different lifestyles from one another. Most are described by the area they inhabited. North Pacific. Woodlands. The Great Desert. Before contact, people gave themselves their own names, called tribes. Many people nowadays still identify themselves by the name of their tribe. When you see the word Indian, do you think of this Lakota Sioux or this Powhatan? Both are very cool, but let's update. New data from National Household Survey show that 1,400,000 people had an Aboriginal identity in 2011. 4.3% of the population. According to the U.S. Census Bureau in 2010, there were roughly 5.2 million American Indians and Alaskan Natives living in the U.S. 1.7% of the population. Indians, Métis, Eskimos, American Indians, Aboriginals, Alaskan Natives, Natives, First Nations is recognized, Métis is recognized, Inuit is recognized. Let's meet some First Nation. Soto, Lumbee, Cree. Choctaw, Ojibwe, Oneida, Métis, Cherokee, Inuit, Shoshone, Coast Salish, Aztec, Navajo, Inuit, Métis, Father, part Cree, Blackfoot, Royal Family of the Narragansett Tribe, Muskogee Creek, that's the end of this lesson. I'm Musquatrax, and I'm Cree.